네 안녕하세요 시쿤입니다 요즘 유튜브에 들어가면 정말 어렵지 않게 볼수 있는 컨텐츠가 있죠 바로 국뽕 컨텐츠입니다 저도 한국인으로서 참 좋아하긴 하는데 최근에는 이게 너무 자주 올라와서 가짜뉴스도 많고 가끔 좀 보기 불편하다는 생각도 좀 들긴 하는데 그래서 그런지 얼마 전에 한국의 이런 국뽕 컨텐츠에 한국인들이 열등감이 쩐다 뭔다 하면서 뭐 칭찬해달라고 조른 여친 같다라는 뭐 영상이 있더라고요 아 열등감이라 Have you heard of the Kupong Contest? Kupong? Uh, I don't know. Uh, yeah. It's kind of a video on okay. YouTube which is like a foreigners are talking about Korean culture. Like, uh, oh, Korea has this, has this. This is amazing. Ah. And we don't have this. And then talking about the news that other countries are complimenting Korea on the management of this crisis. Mm -hmm. Have you watched this type of video? I actually watched a lot of those videos like oh, really? since I live here in Korea, you know. Uh, I don't think so. No. no. So what do you think about this? Korea is an interesting country and the Korean culture is pretty interesting. And for a foreigner, when someone comes to Korea and lives for like a short period of time here, there is a lot of interesting things that you can see in Korea that you, you don't see in other countries, like especially in Europe and the United States. I think Korea deserves to talk about it and about its culture in the media. You know, it's it's a good thing. It's not a bad thing at all, you know. Uh, well, I think it's good because I don't know for people to know about Korean culture and how Korea deals with problems like coronavirus now. I think it could be good. Yeah. <laughs> Informative? Yeah. Is there the same kind of video coming out in your country? Sort of, yeah. I think this thing became like kind of global trend, you know, like everybody wants to talk about like their culture. Yeah. They want the foreigner to show the world that like this country is better than like what you think about mm. it. But I think no one is doing this as good as like foreigners in Korea or like Koreans collaborating with foreigners in here. Yeah, I think uh, there is the same kind of videos in, in, in Spain, yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Yeah, no. I don't know. No, no in yeah. France. Any different point of views about sure. this video? Sure. Uh, some people say South Korea seems desperate to be complimented and getting attention. That's why they keep making this type of videos. Because they have a serious interior feeling. Uh, what do you think about this? I partly agree, but not totally. Because like in other Asian countries, like everybody is like looking forward to know more about Korea because of the Korean drama and the the kebab. So like it's became more like like something like really interesting, especially for the young generation. So I think it's a cool thing. It's not a bad thing at all. Like I think it can be true at some point, but it's like not only Korea does that kind of videos wanting to explaining. Korean situation also other countries that kind of videos about Korea too mm -hmm. like Korea is doing amazing with this situation let's do it like Korea it's really common nowadays in Spain too mm -hmm. my family and friends of Spain I, I always saying oh wow you're in Korea you are really good with the coronavirus we should do like Korea oh I think that's not true shouldn't be true because Korea is great country so I don't think that mean, I think. Do you think like that? I'm very proud of my country. I don't think so. But uh, sometimes it's too much of uh -huh. So you guys do think that you deserve to make this kind of video? Yeah. Okay. Okay, if yeah. you watch this kind of video praising your own country, what would you feel? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it's good. I think yeah. I, I could be proud of my country. Yeah. yeah. You will be happy to yeah. have this good uh, aspect of friends in videos. Right? Yeah. Because you are from France. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You love your country. Yeah. 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 <laughs> 네 이런 의견이 있었습니다 네 대부분 좋게 말씀해 주셨는데 그럼 또 여기서 꼭 나오는 댓글 있죠 한국에 있으니 당연히 좋은 말만 해주지 라고요 그래서 아주 특별한 게스트를 모셨습니다 안녕하세요 저는 마크입니다 반갑습니다 Quality of the English teaching in Korea is not that high You just have native speaking babysitters basically Shut your mouth I'm from the Netherlands Tinder is like used to find sex quickly Mostly it's like you know you wanna you wanna f I'm from the Netherlands Dumb Ignorant A lot of them are just so shitty I'm from the Netherlands. 저는 마크니다. 반갑습니다. 네, 이 친구입니다. 어, 마크는 2년 전에 제 영상에 출연한 이후 고향 땅에 돌아갔다가 얼마 전 한국으로 다시 돌아왔는데요. 이 친구 특징이 영상 보시면 아시겠지만 굉장히 솔직합니다. 그런데 재밌는 건이 친구가 예전에 국뽕 콘텐츠에 출연을 했더라고요. <웃음> 그래서 마크한테 해당 건에 대해서 물어보면 좀 제대로 된 답변을 들을 수 있을 것 같아서 제가 직접 마크를 찾아가 인터뷰를 진행해 봤습니다. 네, 바로 확인해 보시죠. Oh, I'm okay. 
It's been a long time since I've been in Korea, but uh, it's good to be back. So, do you know Kukpong content? Yeah, it shows up on my Facebook and my YouTube feed from now to from from time to time. But yeah, I try to avoid it as much as possible. To me, it all just looks fake as hell. Like I, it, I, I, I watched some, but some of my friends did some. And I'm watching that, like no, no, I don't want to watch this. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm part of it, but I don't want to watch it. Like, the thing is, people do those things to get money. So, if you get money for it, why not, you know? But it doesn't mean I watch that. I don't watch what I'm in. Only the interview we do, because that's cool, but the rest I don't watch. So, when you were acting in front of a camera for that kind of a context, were you approaching that, or just the difficulty was the honest feeling? Uh, when I do this, no, I, they pay me to do a job, so. <laughs> I think, I think it, work, it brings the whole day together. I like, didn't expect to have this much fun. If, I, if, if it was my own YouTube channel or something, I would just be honest. But they pay me to, to do a job, so I do that job. So I'm overly excited when I eat bulgogi or shit. Yeah! It's kind of against your rule, because you're always being honest. Yes, very much. But I also like not starving to death and being able <laughs> to pay my rent. So yeah, I have to play the white monkey from time to time. Cause yeah, I like I like to eat. <laughs> I don't want to skip my meals. <laughs> so yeah, if somebody pays me, what is it, Ishimangon, to pretend I really love bibimbap, I'll do that. <laughs> Most of those things you see are fake. Uh, or super exaggerated. If, if we're on set, there's a producer, uh, we do a take and then the pr producer goes, oh, big energy, big energy. And then we exaggerate a little bit, oh, no, no, big energy, bigger energy. We're like, okay. Yeah, yeah. And then the 3D is like, oh, yeah, yeah, good. What the hell is this? <laughs> Okay, here is an example. This is corn. The topic is this. Okay, the topic is this, so I have to pretend I'm on set? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Whoa, mashkita! Oh, I can't wait to try it. I'm really hungry, so let's go eat. Just look at the color. It's so vibrant and pretty. Mmm. Oh, whoa. This is from a Pyonijon, but this is the best corn I've ever eaten in my life. I really love corn. I can't get anything like this in my country. I can only get this in Korea. It is my... <laughs> I'm starting to feel sick because I really hate core. Oh. <laughs> this type of video is becoming a trend in Korea right now. So many cookbook videos get views. Uh, is there the same kind of videos coming out in your country? No. <laughs> Dutch people won't do this. And if foreigners in the Netherlands would do something like this, Dutch people would just laugh at them, I think. There, is, there are no videos about how amazing Dutch food is. Because it's not amazing. I mean, I mean not just the food, just mm. the culture or system. I haven't seen any though. There is like some real news pages about Dutch news in English, but I don't see any of this over-exaggerated fake video stuff. I think Dutch people don't care about that at all. The food is a bit ambiguous because, you know, some people like this, some people dislike it. So mm. there's so many different perspectives. Yeah. So I couldn't say it's a fake, but... Uh, yeah, okay, the exaggerated yeah. part, yeah. But I, I love Korean food. Like, I prefer eating Korean food than Dutch food, <laughs> for sure. And I live in Korea, so I, I eat Korean food all the time. But the over-exaggerating, like, for instance, if they if I see them eat, eating kimchi jjigae, I, I love kimchi jjigae, but if they're pretending it's like the best kimchi jjigae in their life, oh yeah, it's still kimchi jjigae. Or when you go have barbecue, it's like, yo, it's the best barbecue. It's like, yeah, you literally just put meat on the grill. So, come on. Okay, uh, there are many different point of views about this video. Some people say South Korea seem desperate to be complimented and getting attention. That's why they keep making these type of videos constantly, hmm. and because they have a serious inferiority feeling. Inferiority complex. Yeah. Okay. What do you think about? It? could make sense. I think for some people that definitely is the case. That's a kind of a mixture. It could be a combination of inferiority complex and nationalism, basically. So we have both fields playing that game, but being wanting to be liked by others, I think is very human and being proud of where you come from. I don't know, I, I don't believe in that. I'm, I'm not proud to be Dutch or something. I was just born in the Netherlands, but yeah, for some people that could be a thing. Maybe they don't have much else to be proud of. So if they see people liking Korean food, then that makes them happy. So you mean Agree with this opinion? Oh uh, yeah, I think that that's part of the case. Like some people would, uh, they might not think of Korea that well. They have a negative view about their own country, and then they see people liking their food or liking a part of their culture, and they're like, oh, it's not that bad. Look, the foreigners like it. And then the other ones is like, oh yeah, Korea number one. Korea number one. And then they see uh, foreigners uh, liking their stuff as well. So like, yeah, you see, I'm right. Korea is the best. Blah blah blah. I think both of them could be the case of why these kind of videos are so popular in Korea right now. 
So what would you feel if you watch a video like uh, other countries are complimenting your country? <laughs> Uh, it, it really depends on what, what the case is, like if you look at Dutch multiculturalism and open-mindedness, the fact that gay people can get married or legalize marijuana, that's something you can talk about, but if I see somebody complimenting Dutch food, I'll, be, I'll call them a liar. <laughs> like, why are you doing this? <laughs> why, did you never go to any other country and eat their food? Because that's what we do, we steal food from all the other countries. <laughs> Dutch traditional food is not something we, uh, most people are proud of or most people care about. Everybody knows that. We have like a cookie, that's it. <laughs> so you prefer Korean food? Yeah, corn. Oh, corn. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I hate corn. <laughs> you support this kind of videos? Well, people should do whatever they want. I just don't want to do that super extra exaggerated stuff. Okay, uh, what about the fact that Korea deals with the virus? Uh, I think Korea did great, for real. My country is messing it up. They are really hesitant about masks. They are not doing social distancing. They only care about themselves. They're selfish, and I thought my country, their people were smarter than they are, but apparently they're just stupid. And how Korea did it, I think it's, uh, I think it's great. Everybody's using masks, social distancing in most places. It's better than uh, what you see in other places. You can see it in Korea's infection cases and how much they tested and how little deaths they are. So yeah, why not? Korea did well. The cases are getting increased. Yes. But still? Still, it's like nothing. If I compare it to my country, Korea is three times as big as my country. And they, in my country have way more many cases and way more deaths. And then now Korea has like 50 new cases a day. It's like nothing. It's like, it's like, Korea is huge and Seoul is so densely packed. Yeah, Only 50 yeah, yeah. a day is like nothing. And Korea is doing testing everywhere. I'm sorry, I'm not exaggerating right now. This is like <laughs> really how it is, okay? Just want to be clear here. They're doing a good job. So if you're gonna leave in the comments that I'm bullshitting now, I'll find you. <laughs> oh, you saw when, uh, when the, the Itaewon super spreader happened, they did mass testing on everybody. Everybody could get free corona tests and they texted everybody multiple times. I think that's great. Some people are worried about privacy, but shit, it's for the best of the country. I have interviewed someone from the Netherlands. Yes. She said South Korea is getting recognized in our country. Yeah. Is it true? I think so. The Korean wave is going over the over the world with uh, with K-pop and drama and movies. Netflix has really good uh, selection of Korean dramas and movies right now. Parasite did really well and they got recognition from that. And now uh, Korea is handling the corona situation uh, really well. So they're getting there. Thanks for your time. You're welcome. Thank you for picking me up from the airport. <laughs> 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 Thank you for the corn. <laughs> 네 그렇다고 합니다 저도 국뽕 참 좋아하는데요 앞서 말했듯이 요즘 이런 영상들이 너무 많아서 좀 과하다 싶다 라고 느끼긴 하는데 국뽕이 조회수가 잘 나오는 게 현실이니까 뭐 유튜브 입장에서는 왜 그렇게 만드는지 이해는 됩니다만 시청자 입장에서 볼때 안타까운 건 사실인 것 같습니다 뭐 어쨌든 팩트는 이겁니다 한국은 잘하고 있으니 앞으로도 잘하자 힘내자 네끝 오늘 영상 여기까지입니다 영상이 좋았으면 좋아요와 구독 버튼 꼭 눌러주시고요 저는 다음 영상으로 다시 찾아뵙도록 하겠습니다 지금까지 시쿤이었습니다. 감사합니다. 야.